fantasized about this night for 20 years. It's like in my mind, Gordon has become this well-educated romantic, loves children and writes poetry. But I really shouldn't get my hopes up because it's been hours and what if he doesn't show up? Wait, there he is. <laughs> oh my, don't just sit here. Go to him. Don't let him get away. Yes, very funny. This is a big waste of time because I'm sure Gordon has moved on with his life. That makes me the biggest loser in the world. Am I supposed to say something? Okay, uh... So you're alone, you're childless, you're pinning all of your romantic hopes on some acne-scarred kid you haven't seen for 20 years, but that doesn't make you a loser. <laughs> Makes you mild. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Well, you have to admit, your love life has been sort of like a train wreck. It has not! Hey, look, I'm not judging you. God, I admire you. If I had been rejected by as many men as you have, I'd be a big, fat lesbian by now. <laughs> you know, I have always been a good friend to you, and you have always put me down. Tonight was really important to me, and I'm just not going to take it anymore. I have too much self-respect. You're not Gordon, are you? 